what are pre image resistance second pre image resistance and collision resistance in cryptography in this video we will discuss that in detail we know that a cryptographic hash function is a mathematical algorithm that takes data of arbitrary length as input and maps the data to a bit array of a fixed size called the hash value the mapping is such that the same input data always generate the same hash value it is easy to compute the hash value of a message but it is computationally infeasible to derive the message from the hash value even if we make a small change in the input data that will generate a new hash value that is extensively different from the previous hash value it is computationally infeasible to generate a message that hashes to a given hash value and it is computationally infeasible to find two messages that produce the same hash value there are many well known cryptographic hash functions like md5 sha1 sha2 sha3 etc and these cryptographic hash functions are extensively used in digital signatures message authentication codes etc a good cryptographic hash function should withstand various types of cryptographic attacks it should have specific properties so that it becomes difficult for a cryptanalyst to perform cryptanalysis pre image resistance second pre image resistance and collision resistance are such properties that make a cryptographic hash function cryptographically strong as per the pre image resistance property for a given hash value h it is computationally infeasible to find a message m such that h is equal to hash of m this property makes a cryptographic hash function a one way function as per the second pre image resistance property for a given message m1 it is computationally infeasible to find a different message m2 such that hash of m1 is equal to hash of m2 this property is sometimes referred to as weak collision resistance and as per the collision resistance property it is computationally infeasible to find two messages m1 and m2 such that hash of m1 is equal to hash of m2 and such a pair of messages m1 and m2 is called a cryptographic hash collision this property is sometimes referred to as strong collision resistance please note that the property of collision resistance implies second pre image resistance but it does not imply pre image resistance the property of pre image resistance second pre image resistance and collision resistance ensure that an attacker cannot change a message without changing the hash value of a message an attacker cannot craft a message that has a specific hash value given a message and its hash value an attacker cannot find another message that has the same hash value and an attacker cannot find two different messages that have the same hash value in other words an attacker cannot replace a message with another message without changing its hash value i hope this helps interested viewers who want to know more please visit the website of the security body or refer to the book cryptography and public key infrastructure the security body also provides many cyber security courses the relevant links are provided in the description you can also subscribe to us and get notifications on recent videos